Well, I want to give a uh, quick testimony on something. Actually, this was, uh, I ran one frequency, uh, Parkinson's Temporary Hand Tremor Relief. Uh, it's frequency 6,000. And um, I'm going to tell you the truth. Though. I've been trying to, um, I've been using Spooky Remote Remote on my cousin for uh, you know, a slight case of Parkinson's. One hand is always kind of tremoring, but she doesn't have it too bad. It doesn't. It doesn't progress too much. And I was running various programs on Parkinson's. I know one time she said she forgot it like it was even there. It didn't seem like it was. And she didn't tell me when that was because I was trying so many different things. And I don't even know if it was a fluke or not. But I was, I've been trying to use the spooky remote. Now, if you're familiar with this Rife machine, they, got, they use a remote um, Mobius coil where you have the person's DNA in the Mobius coil and you transmit the frequencies via quantum entanglement. Now, I think that works, but in a case of quantum, uh, in a case of Parkinson's, um, I'm going to actually tell you something. I just tried this, and it was uh, just a few hours ago, actually. She stopped by, and she already left, but um, I, um, I tried this with the handhelds, the contacts with the handhelds versus using the remote. And I used frequency 6000. I figured that would be the best one. It says calming, Parkinson's temporary tremor relief, Parkinson's disease, relaxation to produce, sedation, uh, muscles to relax, facial cramps, you know, inflammation. Uh, pretty much that seemed like to be the best one to try. I did that for 10 minutes, actually 12 minutes, and it was like night and day. But it was contact mode. Now, I've been using it, and I'm not knocking that. I'm not saying that remote mode doesn't work. But, you know, maybe if you're trying to get rid of Parkinson's um, tremors, definitely try this contact mode. Um, it was like night and day. Uh, then we went out and had something to eat, and um, it was like an hour later, the relief was still there. It was like barely perceptible. I'd have to really pay attention to see that the hand was shaking just a little bit. So it was, uh, you know, it went from one thing and then it got I don't know how long it's going to last. I'm going to have to call her up because she's actually on the road and uh, find out because, um, you know, I figured when she stopped by down this way because she was visiting my other cousin down this way in Florida. And, um, you know, it, it just was like a total calming effect. Total, total calming effect. Now, I've been trying this stuff with the remote mode for quite a while. It did not work on Parkinson's. So, you know, not that it's, and, I, and I've used remote on, well, I don't want to even, I used it on the cat fleas. I just couldn't believe that worked. But I'm just going to tell you, though, if it doesn't seem to work with this, if Spooky 2 doesn't seem to work good in, re, in remote mode, try the contact mode. Try the contact mode. It might take a little time. But um, I was surprised. I mean, I think the words, you know, it's just only one case. I'm not a doctor. I'm not somebody. I've, I've read a lot about this energy medicine. I've read about all the theories. I thought this frequency would be one of the better ones to try. And I only used 6,000. There's a lot of other frequencies to use with Parkinson's. You could take iodine or kelp pill, pills a lot of times or even more vitamin C, might have more vitamin D. Sometimes they, there's been cases where that helped a lot. Just plain nutrition helped a lot. But she was down here and visiting for a while. And, uh, of course, the cats were hiding under the bed because somebody came into the house, you know. But <laughs> the three cats, you know, Putin, Rocky, and uh, Goldie were hiding under the bed. Uh, but um, <laughs> I says, you know, and she kind of looked at me like, yeah, yeah. I said, just humor me. Hold these two handhelds. And it was for 12 minutes. I ran it on 6,000. Um, I didn't even use the software. I just used the plane generator. Uh, I used it on a square wave. I put the amplitude all the way up to 20 volts, which means 10 volts up, 10 volts down. That's what it actually means. 20 volts means point to point, 10 volts positive, 10 volts negative. Just a plain square wave, 12 minutes, and it made an extreme major difference. It was like I had to really look at her hand to see that there was like a very slight imperceptible movement and when we went to lunch I figured all that was a good hour or so later it was still good it was still good 
I think this is a pretty damn hot tip. So if you got Parkinson's disease, now you don't have to necessarily get spooky tool or anything. I'm not selling this stuff. I don't have any financial affiliation with these people. It's just something I have. I'm not supposed to be going around treating people. This was my cousin. I said, hey, try this. So he's going to get one of these damn things now. <laughs> I says, go ahead and get the damn thing. I says, I've been telling you, you ought to try this stuff. You know, it's not that much money. Well, it worked. It worked. Six. It was frequency 6,000. Now, now that's listed as in spooky as calming. But if you look in the other Parkinson's frequencies, um, a lot of times you'll find um, you'll find it as um, there's what do you call it uh, uh, different things that are incorporated for thick six thousand. As a matter of fact, it could be um, Parkinson's uh, temporary tremors, like you might see six thousand for yeah. Actually, that's one of the longer frequencies used for five minutes. I just put it on a one, the one, and one frequency, 12 minutes. So let me just try this damn thing. And it worked. It worked. It worked. Now there's other frequencies. I think there's like 470 is another one. 169 is another frequency. But there's stuff in the software. And also, um, detoxifying the body is another thing that could possibly help with Parkinson's. But I think Parkinson's also, you know, it could also be coconut oil is another good thing to take. But I was surprised about this, and I just want to say that I was running the remote, and I'm not knocking the remote. I'm not saying anything bad about it, but maybe for, like, hand tremors when you want you want to actually be holding the contacts because I was running this remote stuff on her for months and months now, and one time something she said must have worked, but she didn't tell me what the hell I did because I kept changing things up, and... um you know, I don't even know what the hell I did because one time she said it was like gone for a day, and I said, well, "Really? Tell me what that? What did I? You know, what day was it? I don't remember." So great, you know. But so I was anxious when she came over. I knew she was coming through because she was visiting my other cousin down near Tampa, and um, I tried six thousand for twelve minutes with the handhelds, plain square wave, uh, and like if you set the spooky two at twenty volts. At 6,000 hertz, you don't, you basically, it's imperceptible. You might feel it a tiny bit. If it's at a lower hertz, you'll feel it like really zapping. But um, if it's at 6,000 hertz, you won't even feel it barely, if, if at all. But it was enough. Whatever it does, it did, it actually did do the job. And I don't know how long it's going to last because I'm going to have to call her on the phone and ask her later, you know, what, how long it lasted. But it definitely lasted for at least an hour and a half so far for 12 minutes time and i'm figuring if you know if you're doing this every day i'm kind of wondering what it's going to do to parkinson's is it going to fix it or is it going to provide a lot of relief and um you know it's one case where the the um the contact mode where you're holding the handhelds was vital it was like night and day couldn't believe this i mean i don't know people are i let me put it this way. I think if somebody does this, I'm not a salesman. You can get any generator and try this out. I don't know if you can get any of them cheap as Spooky 2 generator, though. But um, if you have a frequency generator, if you know somebody that has one, you might want to try that 6,000 frequency at a square wave before you even buy anything with the handhelds and see if it works. And see if it works. I was flabbergasted. Totally, totally flabbergasted. And she's had this for oh, five, six years or something like that. So major, major, major difference in 12 minutes time. So, you know, you could be watching TV or watching a movie and running these programs, holding these handhelds for whatever, run, whatever, like a 30-minute program, various frequencies. And uh, it might make a difference. It, it just made a difference, I know, right away. Now, like I said, it's the first day we tried it, and uh, I don't know how long it's going to last, but... It's definitely lasted at least an hour and a half so far, so that's all I know, and I just want to put this out here because uh, sometimes you want to use those um, handhelds, and frequency 6000 is listed as Parkinson's Temporary Tremor Relief, Parkinson's Disease Relaxation to Produce, 
uh, sedation, pain relief, pain relief, muscular pain relief, muscle re muscles to relax, multiple sclerosis six, uh, you know, other fibromyalgia, facial cramps, and calming, right? Um, so I, I had a, you know, I had an inkling that might be the best one to try it with the limited amount of time I had with her, with her patients because she probably thought she thought it was snake oil till she tried it and she was like whoa and her uh, boyfriend who was here with her um was like oh my god you know couldn't believe it so anyway that's that's true as a heart attack that's all i'm gonna tell you give me a freaking uh bad expression here it's true as a heart attack that's exactly what happened so it went from tremors to uh you know totally fixing it up to total calmness almost total calmness almost total calmness i'd have to look really close and you'd see a slight little tremor i wouldn't even have noticed it if i didn't really look for it it's just i just kept looking and looking i says it's it's basically gone so and you don't even need to run the program i didn't even run the program i just used the generator and a couple contacts but if you're using the program and you're running the parkinson's you might want to be running these in the contact mode versus the remote mode because i've been trying to remote mode for months now and uh, it hasn't been working for parkinson's but that contact mode worked instantly 12 minutes time so if you're gonna pass this on man i mean it's it's a revelation to me i never knew that i, I mean i was thinking it wasn't working tried the contact mode i think parkinson's is one of those things it's you probably want to really use the contact mode i tried uh, just to give you more detail on the, what I was trying in remote mode was uh, aluminum detox, mercury detox, uh, you know, every uh, uh, multiple sclerosis. I was running frequencies for uh, zinc, uh, magnesium, iodine, vitamin frequencies, uh, brain, no drill frequencies, uh, brain, um, frankincense oil, uh, one of the essential oils. I mean, everything I could think of and trying different things for months and nothing seemed to be working except for one time she told me something worked and I don't know what I did because I'm just like, tell me when you, it's got to, because she didn't believe it was going to work. And then she, uh, she was here and she humored me with this bullshit, you know, it turned out not to be bullshit, it turned out to be really real. It worked. So I'm curious how long it's going to last, but, uh, it's lasted at least an hour and a half and, uh probably it's going to last all day so for 12 minutes time that's not a lot of time to invest to have a lot of relief from parkinson's and uh in this case you got to use the handhelds you have to use the handhelds unbelievable i mean i know i'm putting this out to a, a widespread audience i don't believe it myself till i saw it and i don't sell this stuff <coughs> i'm just telling you what just happened today and um, it, I just couldn't get it to work on a remote except for this one time I don't know if that was a coincidence or what but she's had this for five years and uh, so she's going to get a generator and uh, do her thing